got the first first shipment coming in. Shout out Frankie. He shipped out our samples in a, a Petco packet. <laughs> so the first batch of samples came when Frankie's, I think Frankie or his assistant shipped them. And like I said, Frankie is a legend in this space. This man has made so much money, it's unheard of. Jay, you can quote me on this. <laughs> <laughs> Shipped the samples in a Petco box. <laughs> I think I said it in the video. I said in the video. I said, what did I say? I said, you can take the you can take the man out the hood, but you can never take the hood out the man. You can you can take the man out the hood, but you can never take the hood out the man. You didn't even seal it properly. Alright, so I've been we've been, I've been working on this brand since like January with Frankie. And this is what's the day's date? October 19th. October 20th. 20. Yeah. This is my first time ever seeing the designs in person. Again, this thing started in January. I adopted this brand in January and I didn't see in person a single sample, not a single piece of clothing until October. So like I said, the learning curve that I had to do in terms of patience was immense. To wait that long just to even see a sample, not to launch, just to see one sample. A big learning experience for me. Let's see how they look. The throwback logo? Yeah, see the back. <coughs> the quality is amazing, bro. The prints. Got the Michael Jordan in the front. We got the Kobe too. We're gonna find out. We have a revenge. You don't know about this, right? It's that world champion wrestling. This is real. You know about it or no? No, I don't. This is real nostalgia. <laughs> Old wrestling, John Cena. Bro, I used to have it on the Nintendo 64. Yeah. There it is. Even waiting for Kobe. Kobe is actually one of my favorite. Kobe hoodie and the Kobe T is actually one of my favorite favorites out of the out of the whole collection. This, this is Dang. what you call the legends. <laughs> Every legendary moment of Kobe. Kobe. Look at the front. Every legendary moment is in this one. Oh, I ain't gonna lie. Oh. You know which one I thought this one was when I saw it? He's inside his locker room. Oh, and he's so yeah. we have, I think we have another design. So one of the biggest lessons that I had to learn over these 11 months of trying to get started, learning patience. I think what I've learned from this business and my past businesses, there's so much waiting that is involved in business. And I'm a very impatient person. I'm someone that's always trying to get to the next step. I'm always trying to move forward. And if I'm not moving forward, if I'm not working, if I don't feel like I'm making progress, I go crazy. 